In this video, we're going to be talking about stylizing your text. Go ahead and hover over whichever text you'd like to stylize. You'll see an orange menu bar pop up. And what you want to select and click on is the style icon. Once you click on the style icon, you'll see the style tab pop up in the right hand side of the screen. What we're going to be covering in this tutorial is working with fonts. Under font family, you'll easily be able to click the drop down and go ahead and select whichever font you'd like. You can select Georgia, for example, and you'll see a live preview of your text style changing. The Font Awesome drop down menu is going to allow you to add an icon at the beginning of your text. For example, if we click email, you'll see a live preview of that icon being added to your text. To change the size of your font underneath font size, you can drag the gray anchor to either increase or decrease the size of your text and you'll see a live preview on the left hand side of the screen. We don't recommend changing the mobile text that is set to the standard for mobile. If you would like, you will be able to increase or decrease the size of the text. You won't be able to see a live preview, but that will change the size of your text on mobile. One of the really cool features built into the software is you have the ability to change from font size in percent to font size in pixels. And all you need to do to change that is go ahead and click on this icon to the right of the font size. Now it's important to understand the difference between these two settings. If we have font size set to pixels, if we go ahead and preview this page, as we increase or decrease the size of the page, that text is going to remain the same. Now, if we switch this to font size in percent, you'll see that as we increase or decrease the size of your page, the size of the text is actually going to change alongside it. So when making the page smaller, you see that the text size also changes to be smaller. And as you increase the size of the page, the text size increases with the size of the page. So again, you have the ability to switch between font size in percent and font size in pixels by clicking this little button.